Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Angie and on my channel I like to do all things homemaking. Today I'm excited to bring you my first fall video for 2024. I'm going to be decorating my entryway and powder room for fall. I hope this gives you some new ideas and you enjoy the video. Before I even decorate, I like to start with a clean slate. So I've cleaned my floors and dusted well, and now I'm just adding back some of the things that I keep here year round. And here I'm just adding a linen table runner that I found on Amazon to the top of this entry table. And I already tied that big frame up to hang in front of the window there with some ribbon. And this is just a vase I found at Kirkland's a few years ago that I put leaves in. And now I'm just using two of these bushes with blackberries on them that I got at Hobby Lobby. And then this one stem of orange flowers here. And then that's one stem of sunflowers and a pick that had some different sized pumpkins on it. I'm just setting that in front of the window here as my focal point. I found this little candy dish at Hobby Lobby last year. I believe they have it every year. And then this is just a little basket I found at Hobby Lobby in the spring that I just put some loose leaves and some faux acorns in. And this is just a scented pack that I found at Hobby Lobby. And now I'm just going to scatter some loose leaves around. And of course you can use Leaves that you have that have fallen off of bushes, like some of my faux bushes started losing leaves, so I just collected those. Or you can use leaves from outside, or maybe acorns or anything like that. I'm just going to sprinkle those around here. And this little stool I found at the Dollar General a few years ago. I'm going to place this faux pumpkin from Hobby Lobby this year on top. And then I'm going to add this pumpkin pick along with this little pumpkin. And you can just kind of mess around with it and see how you like it. And this is a vintage picnic basket that my mom gave me. I was helping her move into their new house and she said she didn't want it and I've actually been looking for one so I was really excited about getting it. I'm just going to add these leaf bunches to it here. And then I'm going to add some of these sunflower picks to it. I'm kind of looking for a fall picnic type look here. And then this is just a plaid full blanket that I had. I love the colors in it. So I'm going to drape that on top. And then I'm going to add one of my books to the top of it. Looks like we're ready to go on a picnic. Now to the top I'm going to add this Hello Fall sign and I'm just going to switch the basket around to where the candy dish is in front so the sh sign shows up better. And then I'm going to be adding a string of fairy lights here. And I'm just going to drape these around this window frame. And I've been switching all my lights to timers so they all come on around the same time every evening. I don't like having to remember to turn things on. So that's been helpful. Now I'm going to be moving over to the stairs railing and I'm going to tie, using the same ribbon, this garland, this pre-lit garland I bought at Hobby Lobby last year. They do have it this year also. And I'm 
This is also lights that are on a timer. So I'm just going to tie this on. And I was wondering if any of you have started decorating for fall and what your favorite season is. And also, do you decorate your whole house for fall or what rooms do you like to decorate? So this is the final look of our entryway. Now we're moving on to our powder room. This is our powder room when everything's taken out and it's a clean slate. I'm gonna start by adding this piece of burlap that I had from last year. And then I'm just adding this pumpkin that has a candle inside it. And then these are just paper or towel it's for people to wipe their hands on and then this is a hand towel I got at home good last year so I'm gonna add that to the towel ring here and this is some pumpkin cinnamon soap from home good and this picture I bought a couple years ago at Hobby Lobby they may still have it I'm gonna hang it here Now I'm going to add a couple books to the table here because I bought this little lamp this year from Hobby Lobby and I want to have it be a little bit higher. So I put that on the books. I did not realize that I had no electrical outlet behind that chest so I'm having to plug it in kind of an awkward place right now. But I'm going to I'm hanging this picture here on the wall. And this is what it looks like. And I guess you can buy battery operated light bulbs, which is what I'll probably end up replacing it with. So that I don't have a cord stretched across there. So this is the final look of this area. And then this is the look without the lamp plugged in. But I think it turned out cute. So I hope this gave you some new ideas. I always try to decorate a little different each season. And I really like how it turned out. I'm so glad that you came today. I appreciate you being here. I've missed being on YouTube. And I've missed talking to you in the comments. I hope you're having a great start to your month and that you enjoy this season. And I'll be back on soon with a new video. I'll see you later. Bye.